second. Yes, he does. You know, his wide force. From an economic the Piedmont is the area from the mountains basically to the coastal plain and encompasses the eastern forest, uh, the farmlands are in this area, and of course the streams that flow through that area. What I tell my students about the, the Piedmont is how rich it is in terms of wildlife, the diversity of plants, the wildflowers that are here. PEC has been a wonderful partner. They've helped us in many aspects on this trail uh, from planting uh, several hundred trees They've also uh, helped through grants to purchase a lot of the equipment we need. This stream, this riparian habitat along Kentucky Creek is a wildlife corridor that allows wildlife to move back and forth without the impact of civilization on it. And if we could do this throughout the Piedmont, protect these areas, get other people involved, we could do tremendous things. You know, the three biggest economic drivers in Virginia are agriculture, forestry, and tourism. And the common denominator uh, for all three of those things is open space. And since about the mid-1970s, we've been losing forest land across the Commonwealth. And one of the ways we can help mitigate that is through conservation easements. And PECs on the front lines, you know, helping protect those areas you know, building awareness and uh, getting us in touch with landowners that would be interested in, in conveying an easement to us. Conservation easements uh, assure that the Piedmont will always be characterized by its open spaces, its healthy environment, and its cultural resources which will be protected in perpetuity. The PEC has an absolutely marvelous staff which can help a landowner understand the benefits of doing a conservation easement and help him through the process of creating and donating one. For me, PEC is, 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 a, is a support, you know? It's like, it's like your backbone, you know? You know you got somebody there that's on your side. The things that they do to promote BEPs and local food, it's all very wonderful for the outreach into the community um, and it's stuff that I couldn't do on my own as a farmer. Their main concern is that we save farmland and we save the, the heritage that we have here. I just have to say I'm very grateful to PEC for, for initiating this program and giving all these hundreds of children the, the opportunity to, to have this experience. Uh, what we try to do here is just get them outside, get them to come to an understanding of how the natural systems work and to come to an appreciation and a respect for our fellow earth-dwelling creatures. There are just hundreds of things in this community that wouldn't have happened if PEC wasn't there to promote the citizen participation, to provide the information that citizens need, to be present at all the meetings. I don't know if people realize that PEC attends all the county board meetings. Without PEC, it's hard to imagine what Alma County would be like. Well, as a suburban mother who was staying home, I was able to find my purpose and do what I had in mind and accomplish it because of the fact that PEC supported what we were trying to do. And I think PEC has a huge role in this county. If we're not involved in the policy making, if we're not standing up for what we believe in, everything that we care about is going to be slowly destroyed. It's not politics, it's how we are uh, using our land, it's how we are treating our land. Amir and I were very drawn to this area, the whole Piedmont area, because it was such a beautiful area and the feeling that we had driving through and looking for property felt right. There's infrastructure here, there's support for local food here, and having 
an organization like PEC instantly gives us access to like-minded people who are there to network with us, support us, the resources, mainly because of the Buy Fresh, Buy Local uh, publication. The Piedmont Environmental Council gave Mary Lynn and me the opportunity to participate as citizens in great fights to protect the landscape and to protect the history. One of them was the fight to keep the Disney Corporation from building a sprawling city on the edge of the Manassas battlefield. In our view, the PEC over the last 25, 30 years has become the single most significant regional conservation organization in America. And we're grateful for that. Add your voice. Join the Piedmont Environmental Council. We need more citizens to participate with the Piedmont Environmental Council. Add your voice. Protect your woodland legacy. Add your voice to protect the Piedmont. Honor the things that make your heart sing, and if the Piedmont makes your heart sing, definitely get involved with PEC.